In the world of digital finance, the month of February saw a staggering over $67 million stolen from decentralized finance platforms, or DeFi. The lion's share of these losses, a hefty 97%, came as a result of hacking attacks. The Ethereum blockchain bore the brunt of these attacks with a total of 12 incidents, a staggering 85.71% of losses across all targeted chains. A comparison to January's figures paints an interesting picture. February's losses were notably lower, at nearly half of January's eye-watering $133.4 million. But don't be fooled. This could suggest improved security measures by DeFi platforms, yet a year-to-date increase of 15.4% in losses to over $200 million contradicts this theory. Prominent breaches in February occurred on Playdap and Fixed Float, with losses amounting to $32.5 million and $26.1 million respectively. Ethereum again was the most targeted, with Bitcoin and BNB chains each seeing one incident, accounting for 7.14% of total losses each. While DeFi platforms seem to be an attractive target for cybercriminals, the data suggests that centralized finance platforms pose a greater challenge for attackers. In February, DeFi was the primary target, led by high-profile attacks on Playdap, FixFloat and DualBits. In stark contrast, centralized finance platforms did not witness a single major exploit, a clear indicator of the challenges lying ahead in securing the digital financial world. Remember to stay vigilant in these volatile digital times. Until next time.